<clears throat> Hello everyone, this is Blood Queen Tarot, and I am here to do a um, reading for Virgo. Virgo, this is your mid-monthly reading for November 2022. So this is for November the 15th to the 30th. So Virgo, please keep in mind that the reading, it may or may not resonate with you. Some parts of the reading might resonate, other parts of the reading might not. As well, keep in mind that time is fluid. So this reading can manifest the second half of November. It can manifest later on down the line in time after November. Or this present reading could be past energy for you. If this present reading is past energy for you, then there might be answers or closure for you in this present reading pertaining to your past situation or circumstance. Um, Virgo, I did get a message for you during the pre-shuffle. And Virgo, um, the second half of, half of November, you might receive something. You're going to receive something in the past, Virgo, or the recent past. You could have been going through like um, some type of upheaval, some type of trials or tribulations. Um, this could have been unemployment. Virgo, you might um, get employment the second half of November. Um, if it was some type of information that you didn't know in the past, you might receive the information that you needed to know. Uh, Virgo, you could have been waiting on a phone call from somebody. Virgo, you was going through something. And you might... Um, I heard receiving. Like, right before I clicked on the, the recording. I heard receiving. So, you're receiving something, Virgo, that you could have been waiting on or that you needed. So, this could be money. This could be a paycheck. Um, this could be employment, information. You're receiving something that you needed or that you wanted. I heard, no, what is something that you needed. It's not necessarily a want, but a need, something you needed. All right. So give me Virgo's uh, overall energy. What's Virgo Oracle for the second half of November? Oh, my God. Miracles coming out in reverse. So, miracles coming out in reverse. So, Virgo, that, I don't know. Virgo, you might get what you need. Virgo, you probably wanted more than what you actually needed. So, you're going to get, like, something that you need. So, it's like, Virgo, say like you was playing the lottery. And you wanted to win the million dollars jackpot. It's like, Virgo, you're not going to get the million dollars jackpot, but you might win, like, a $500 scratch-off ticket or something like that. Um, you, you're, Virgo, you're not going to get, okay, Virgo, you're not going to get what you want. You're going to get what you need or something like that. So, Virgo, maybe your imagination could have been bigger than reality or... Something you wanted, Virgo, was a little bit extreme. I'm kind of picking up. You're not going to get exact as much as you wanted. Or, Virgo, you wanted something bigger or something. So, miracles is in reverse. So, Virgo, you're not going to get a miracle. You're going to get something that you need instead of, like, what you wanted or something like that. So you're going to get good news. It's just not going to be what you wanted or how you wanted it. You're going to get something the way you need it or you're going to get what you need and not what you want or something like that. So miracles is in reverse. Or Virgo, somebody might not get a miracle at your expense. Somebody might not get a miracle at your expense as well. Virgo, I'm kind of picking up. You could be blowing something out of proportion. I don't know. Virgo, you could be blowing something out of proportion. And spirit might kind of like give you a reality check. Or something like that. You could be blowing something out of proportion. Or Virgo, you could be saying something is a miracle and it's not a miracle. It's like... um. Virgo, you could be saying something is a miracle and it's not, or something like that. 
something like that going on. All right, so let me do the scoop. I'm going to put three cards for you. We're going we gonna to see what the scoop is for you uh, the second half of November. What's the scoop for Virgo? What's the scoop? We have upgrade. Your life is about to have an upgrade. Yeah, so Virgo, you're going to get something to go your way. Then we have caution. Proceed with caution. Yeah. And then we have romantic thoughts. Having romantic thoughts about you. Okay. So Virgo, what I'm picking up is... Virgo, you probably not in reality about something. Or it's something you not seeing the truth for what it is. So Virgo, whether you a male or a female... Virgo, say like you do hit the lottery. Virgo, you could have a lover around you that just want to use you. Virgo, you love this person more than this person loves you. So, Virgo, it's like you hit the lottery. This person, your lover, Virgo, that loves that you love more than this person loves you. Virgo, somebody might call you. Or, Virgo, this person going to give you what you want. So, Virgo, say like you a man and you won the lottery. And it was this woman that you wanted to have sex with. It's like, Virgo, all of a sudden, she going to have sex with you. Because, not because she love you, Virgo, but because she know you hit the lottery. So, Virgo, your life is about to have an upgrade, but proceed with caution. Because somebody is having romantic thoughts about you. It's like, Virgo, this woman having sex with you is not a miracle. It's like, Virgo, spirit wants you to see something for what it is. This woman... Having sex with you is not a miracle. She's having sex with you because she know you got to upgrade. Virgo, if you the female, if you a female, it's the same thing. Virgo, you could be obsessed with someone. And this person might give you the time of day because they're aware you got to upgrade. And this person giving you the time of day, Virgo, is not a miracle. It's because this person know that you um, got to upgrade. So, Virgo, you can be in denial about something. And I think spirit might give you a reality check. Or he wants you to see something for what it is. Or something like that. Yeah. Virgo, your life is, is about to have an upgrade. But proceed with caution about this person having romantic thoughts about you. Or, Virgo, be careful because a lover might try to set you up. Especially if your upgrade is material. If it's money. Virgo, be careful because somebody might try to rob you. Proceed with caution about somebody having romantic thoughts about you because something could be a setup. Somebody probably want to rob you. But this person is using sex or something like that. Or something, yeah. So what's going on with Virgo? What do Virgo need to know? What can Virgo expect? What's going on with Virgo? All right, the two of pentacles. So, Virgo, this could be you, that two of pentacles. Or you dealing with another earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. This is also my card of somebody could have, like, somebody could be, like, mentally unstable. Sometimes, to me, the two of pentacles is somebody who's having a hard time uh, knowing truth from... Uh, Somebody who has a hard time separating the truth or somebody who can't distinguish truth from a lie or something like that. Like, this could be ignorance is bliss sometimes. Because it's like somebody is busy doing what they doing or somebody is so busy on their perception of something. They don't know what's actually going on. So, Virgo, I'm thinking that two of pentacles is you. I'm going to clarify it. Because, Virgo, you could be so busy doing what you're doing, you don't realize the somebody else's actual um intentions for you because you busy juggling something clarify the two of pentacles i mean no, no. yeah somebody could be a narcissist yeah we got the king of wands coming outside in the reverse <laughs> so virgo you could be dealing with a fire sign you got fire in your chart Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. Then we got the Ace of Wands coming out sideways. We got more fire. Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. Yeah, Virgo, I think you got somebody around you that um want to use you and work love a life. Virgo, somebody probably look at you as unstable. Somebody probably view you as unstable.
Yeah. We got the two of wands. Um, the two of wands, but it's like in reverse. <clears throat> Virgo, somebody could be just like you, or you you and this person, y'all do the same thing. But Virgo, this person like is a little bit more devious than you. Virgo, you can be more innocent than this person. Y'all both got two. So Virgo, you got two pentacles and this person got two wands. But Virgo, this person a little bit more devious than you, or something like that. Or this person is not as trustworthy as you are. So, Virgo, say like you're not a liar. So, Virgo, because you're not a liar, you wouldn't think that somebody else would lie to you because you're not a liar. Or, Virgo, you feel as though just because you in love, you feel as though this other person is in love. So it's like, Virgo, somebody wants something from you, but it's not for the reasons that you think it's for or something like that. Clip out the two of pentacles. It's like, Virgo, this person taking action towards you, but they really not. Because this person is aware something is sideways. Or Virgo, this person is like, something is about sex, but is it really about sex? That ace of wands? Virgo, you could be a female. This could be a man. It's like this man really don't want to have sex with you, Virgo. But if he have to to get money from you, if he got to wine and dine you, sweet talk you, he will. But both of y'all or somebody is ignorant to something, though. Somebody is kind of ignorant to something, or somebody's plan is not going to work exactly how they expected it to. So if I the two of pentacles. The hermit, yeah. Virgo, that two of pentacles is you. Yeah, Virgo, you in your own world. Virgo, you're viewing something from your perspective. Yeah, the two of pentacles with the hermit. Hermit, I'm picking up, Virgo, you in, like, your own world. And it's a fire sign, like, plotting on you or something. Somebody trying to figure out how to manipulate you to get something they want from you. Clarify the king of wands in reverse. Yeah, the knight of swords. Yeah. Virgo, somebody was going to do something against you, but they're going to change their mind because this person going to find out um, that you got to upgrade. And instead of this person offending you, they're just going to like steal from you or manipulate you or using you. Because this person could have been planning on calling the cops on you or this person was planning on um, like putting their hands on you or something. But this person going to change their mind because they might find out you got to upgrade, Virgo. So, Virgo, you could be dealing with an air sign. You got air in your chart. A Libra, a Prince, a Gemini. Clear by the Ace of Wands coming out sideways. Yeah, we got the Three of Wands. Yep. So, something is not what it appears to be. Virgo, you could be thinking this person is your twin and they not. Or this person is your twin, Virgo, but this, your twin not awakened. Or Virgo, you think this this person want a relationship with you? You think, yeah, something is not as stable. This is not a firm, solid foundation. So Virgo, I also see you could have been trying to, uh, Virgo, you could have been looking for a job. And you're not going to get the job you want. Or the job is not going to be on the floor that you wanted it to be on. Or it's not going to be the position that you wanted. And Virgo, the reason for that is because spirit is trying to keep you from somebody that was coming up against you. And you didn't see it or Virgo, you didn't want to accept something. 
So something is um because the four wands is a solid foundation, a firm solid foundation. So this could be employment, this is like a romance, it could be a marriage, it could be your housing situation. Virgo, you might not get the house or the apartment you want because um, Virgo, you was going to get a landlord from hell and spirit could be trying to keep you from some something, somebody that was trying to use you or manipulate you. So something is not what it appears to be. Clarify the hermit. Or Virgo, you're not going to get what you, you're not going to get something that you wanted because spirit trying to keep you from this person. Virgo, you trust somebody too much, and you shouldn't trust this person. Clarify the hermit. So this is like a, concerning work, a lover, or like your housing situation or something. The year the five of wands. So, we got more fire, a Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. Virgo, I heard you're going to smell something. You're going to smell something. So, Virgo, if you a female, Virgo, your lover could have gave you an STD. And you could be having conflict and competition going on in your vaginal area, Virgo. You might smell something. Virgo, your lover knew that they had this STD when y'all had intercourse. Or Virgo, your lover found out right after y'all had intercourse that they had this STD and they gave it to you. So what I also see too, this is either an STD or some type of offense. Virgo, you're going to smell something. Or Virgo, you got a new apartment and something could be going on with the gas. And your landlord knew, but they let you move in anyway or something like that. And Virgo, this person was like waiting for you to say something or waiting for you to confront them. Because they was like going to like call the cops on you or like do something to you, like hit you. Because it's like this person know they wrong. This person know they don't like you like that. This person know they played you. And they was just waiting for you to confront them. And then they was going to either call the cops on you. Or they was going to put their hands on you. So again Virgo. This person. Did offended you. And they knew they offended you. Or they didn't realize that they put you in a situation. To after the fact. But this person was still waiting for you. Like. I know I'm wrong, but if Virgo say something to me, I'm going to hit Virgo over the head or I'm going to just call the cops on Virgo because I already know I'm wrong or something like that. So, Virgo, this could be a landlord or something. Yeah, because, Virgo, you're going to smell something. I heard that with the hermit and the five of wands, I heard you're going to smell something. Clarify the Knight of Swords. Yeah, we got the world. Yeah, Virgo, somebody wanted to, like, attack you before you was able to figure something out. Or somebody want to know if you know. So, Virgo, say, like, your landlord got you on a contract. And they found out the day after you moved in that it was a gas leak or carbon monoxide or mold or something. It's like, Virgo, your landlord wasn't going to say nothing to you because they just wanted the money. So it's like this person was planning on doing something before you could um close out a cycle or get some type of success or something or get proof. So, yeah. So, Virgo, you probably suspicious, but you don't know yet or something. It's like this person... Or, or, or Virgo, somebody done did something to you and you don't know who did it. But it's like the King of Wands, this fire energy, know it was them. Virgo, somebody did something to you and you don't know who did it. And Virgo, it was like the King of Wands or some fire energy or a fire sign. 
Or it could have been an air sign, of an Aquarius, a Libra, an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Capricorn. Clarify the three, the three of wands. The Knight of Cups. Virgo, I, I'm also picking up, and I just heard that somebody um was doing some type of spell work or dark magic on you. So it's like Virgo, say like somebody left like some fish like in your car or in your house. Virgo, you don't know who put the... It, it, it's like you started smelling something, but you don't know who did it. Like somebody did something like... This could be involving like uh, voodoo or something. Or Virgo, somebody just did something to you just to do it because they don't like you. So they left like some old food, some fish, something that take time. It was rotten and then you was starting to smell something. So they could have put it like in your house or in your car. Somebody did something. But Virgo, somebody really don't like you. Somebody you think is cool with you, this person don't like you. Or Virgo, somebody is like doing this to you at work. Somebody could have put something in your desk or something and you don't know who did it. And it started smelling or something. Yeah, Virgo, this person is trying to figure out should they... It's like, Virgo, this person trying to figure out should they express to you that they don't like you or do they want to keep on with with the with the, the shenanigans, the front, them being fake? Virgo, somebody don't like you. Somebody do not like you, Virgo, and this person is trying to figure out how long can I fake the funk? How long can I smile in Virgo face and act like I, and act like, I like Virgo? Something like that. Somebody trying to figure something out. But Virgo, this person is not going to. Virgo, this person was planning on exposing themselves to you. So Virgo, this person could have been planning on telling you, yeah, it was me. I the one who put the fish in, in your in your uh desk at work. I the one who did this, I did it. But Virgo, this person going to find out that you got to upgrade. So they not going to do this. Somebody was going to do something to you. Or Virgo, this person was waiting for you to figure it out. And they wanted you to confront them. And then they was like going to attack you. Yeah. So. Something like that going on. So Virgo, you not getting no miracle. You not getting no miracle, Virgo. Because there's somebody around you, Virgo, you not picking up that this person got an issue with you. Yeah, somebody got an issue with you, Virgo. What's the spell with um the Two of Pentacles, the Hermit, and the Five of Wands? The Fifth House. One's hobbies, interests, recreational, and leisure activities, what one does for entertainment. Okay. So, Virgo, you could definitely be dealing with the, with a Leo. The fifth house is Leo. So, Virgo, you could have been interacting with this person concerning y'all got um, the same hobbies, the same interests. You guys do recreational and leisure activities together. Or you guys do something concerning entertainment together. Or something like that. Something to do with the fifth house. Or Virgo, this is like somebody that you party with. You think this person cool with you, Virgo? This person got an issue with you. Yeah, something. What's the spell with the King of Wands in reverse, the Knight of Swords in the world? I also see Virgo, this person did something in the past or they going to do something in the second half of November. This person did something and Virgo, this person was going to like try to blame it on you.
but they not Virgo because this person going to find out you, that you got to upgrade. So instead of doing harm to you, Virgo, this person is going to like um, use you, whatever. They was going to do harm to you, but Virgo, you're going to get an upgrade. So they plan on using you or something. The eighth house. This situation involves cycles, death, and rebirth. Someone's attitude towards change, personal growth. Is that Pisces? What is the eighth house? I think that's Pisces, I think. Oh, no, that's Scorpio. Oh. Um, Virgo, be careful because somebody could have planned, somebody could have been planning on killing somebody or this person going to kill somebody. And this person was going to call the cops, but Virgo, you might call this person. So Virgo, say like somebody killed somebody, or this person was planning on killing you, Virgo. Or Virgo, this is somebody you connected to. Somebody either killed somebody or they was planning to, but this person got interrupted by a phone call. Or Virgo, this person done committed a crime, and they was going to do this and then call the cops. And be like, yeah, we got a, a, a body over here. At such and such place. And then they was going to leave the crime scene. Somebody was going to make a phone call. The eighth house is Scorpio. And that's death. So this death might happen. Or this person was planning on doing it. But they got distracted. Or something. Or Virgo. This person was planning on doing harm to you. And then they was going to call the cops or something. This situation involves cycles, death, and rebirth. Someone's attitude towards change, personal growth. Hmm. Virgo, it might be somebody that you need to stay away from. What's the spill with the Ace of Wands sideways, the Three of Wands, and the Knight of Cups? Virgo, this person, you don't know somebody. This person is like a... Virgo, it's somebody you don't know this person. Like, you think you know them. So, Virgo, this person was planning on doing harm to you, or they was planning on doing harm to somebody else. But, Virgo, spirit don't want you around this person. We got the sixth house. What someone does routinely, their responsibilities, their skills, and training, their employment. So the sixth house, that's Virgo. So we got Leo, Scorpio, and Virgo. Or Virgo, somebody was planning on offending you because of a Scorpio. So Virgo, if this is a third party situation in love, whether you a male or a female, Virgo, you could you could be the main lover or you the third party. And Virgo, your lover wanted to get rid of you. They chose they choose the Scorpio over you. Or something like that. So, this is like your employer. Virgo, if you messed around with like your boss or something at work. Virgo, his wife could be a Scorpio. Or something. So, Virgo, you could be messing around with somebody that you work with. Or somebody was going to do a crime at work and then call the cops or something. Virgo, somebody you work with or work for was going to do harm to you. But Virgo, you're going to get an upgrade. 
So Virgo, this person that was planning on doing harm to you, they not going to be able to, or it's not going to be as easy because you're getting moved to a different department or something like that. Because somebody was going to do something, but it's like something happened. And it could be about something, your career. Or Virgo, this um, fire energy is somebody like your competition at work. Virgo, be careful because somebody could have could have been planning on doing harm to you because you got a position at work that they wanted. And it's like, Virgo, you got this position and then this person going to approach you about having romantic thoughts about you. Uh-uh, Virgo, this person don't like you because you got a position at work, at work that they wanted. And this person was planning on offending you. So this could be a co-worker? A distorted feminine? Virgo, if you a man, this woman at work like you, and it could have been her lover that was trying to get her to set you up. So, Virgo, you were sleeping with this woman at work or something? She's a distorted feminine. She could be a karmic. But, Virgo, you going to get an upgrade. And Virgo, her boyfriend or her other lover was trying to get her to help him set you up because you got to upgrade. So Virgo, if you um like a business owner or something, you like in charge of opening and closing, Virgo, be careful. Or you might not get this position, Virgo. You want it to be able to be the one to open the, the store or the business and you close. But Virgo, you might not get this position or something because somebody was planning on robbing you or something. Or something like that. This could be another man out here. Or Virgo, you a female. And this could be a man that's jealous of you. Or Virgo, you I don't know if you lesbian or bisexual or something. It was going to be another woman that offended you over a position at work. Let me, no, the wrong deck. I'm going over. Give me the tea about the two of pentacles, the hermit, the five of wands, and the fifth house. Wasting time, stuck, no changes, limited. Yeah. Yeah, Virgo, you wasting your time with somebody. Because you dealing with somebody that, that got ill intentions towards you. And Virgo, you trying to figure out, figure out why something is stuck, no changes, or why you're limited. And I think it's to save your life. This is either a third-party situation of love, and somebody was going to use a distorted feminine to set you up. Or Virgo, it's like you're not going to get this promotion, Virgo, or you're not going to get as much money or something. Because Virgo, it's like somebody was going to do harm to you. If you would have got this promotion. So something. So Virgo you like dad why I can't never get a job. That pay me such and such. Why I always got to get these low paying jobs. So Virgo you could be stuck in a situation to save your life or something. Because you, you connected to somebody that's a little crazy. This person will hurt you or something. What's the T with the King of Wands in reverse, the Knight of Swords, the World, and the Eighth House? Yeah, Virgo, you're not getting no miracle because it might cost you your life. You're not getting no miracle. <sighs> yeah. Somebody's going to have a hard time threatening you and a happiness hater. Because, Virgo, you're not going to get what this person thought. So somebody is a happiness hater, but they're not going to have a reason to be a happiness hater because, Virgo, you're not getting a miracle. So like I said, I don't know, Virgo, uh, like I said, Virgo, I don't know if you was play playing the lottery. And Virgo, this person told themselves, if Virgo hit that lottery, I'm going to kill Virgo and I'm going to take Virgo money or something. 
So, Virgo, you're not going to hit that um jackpot. You're going to win like a scratch-off ticket or something. You ain't winning that big lottery or something like that. So I heard you didn't get enough for this person to do harm to you. So they not. Because you didn't get enough. You didn't get a miracle or something. Ooh. What's the tea with the Ace of Wands, Sideways, the Three of Wands, the Knight of Cups, and the Six House? Carless, no car repo, car issues. So, Virgo, maybe this person could be jealous of you because of your car. Or, Virgo, this person wanted you to purchase them a car. Something could be about a car. Virgo, somebody could have been using you for a car. Man, Virgo, I don't know what you're going to do. But Virgo, somebody, you need to get away from somebody. This person could be Carlos. It's like Virgo, say like whoever this person is, they was planning on doing harm to you. But it's like Virgo, this person going to find out you got to upgrade. So they like, nah, I ain't going to kill Virgo. I ain't going to do nothing to Virgo because Virgo got this extra money. Virgo got this upgrade and I'm going to use Virgo to get me a car. So instead of instead of killing Virgo, I'ma just I'ma get me a car with the upgrade with the money Virgo got. Or something. Virgo, if you a man, it could be another man that's after you because he's jealous of your car. And y'all could work together or something. Or Virgo, you like a regular worker and this man is your boss. And he could be jealous because he feels as though he the boss. Why he don't have a car like you got a car. Or something like that. So, Virgo, if you a man, be careful. Because it could it could have been a man that's going to use a female to come holler at you, Virgo. But it's a setup. Because this man could be jealous of your car or something. Yeah. Or something like that going on. But I'm going to end it because that's what's going on. Yeah. Virgo, somebody that's carless might be kissing your ass. Or Virgo, this man gonna send a woman to you saying she wanna have sex, but she kissing your ass for this man because they wanna rob you or something. Or they gonna steal your car or something like that. Virgo, you ain't getting no miracle. Virgo, this woman calling you or giving you the time of day or this man calling you, giving you the time of day, this is not a miracle. This is a setup. Yeah, so it's not a miracle. It's a setup, Virgo. Yeah. <clears throat> or Virgo, somebody was gonna commit a crime in your car. Somebody was planning on asking to use your car. Somebody carless. Virgo, this person that you need to get away from, they carless. And they probably wanted to do harm to a Scorpio, but they wanted to use your car to do it. Or something. So, Virgo, your car might break down. You was planning on letting this person use your car. Virgo, something might happen to your car. Your car might get stuck or something. It's because this person was going to commit a crime in your car, Virgo. I see that too. So, Virgo, you not getting no miracle. Virgo, you could have been trying to do somebody a favor. You was going to let this person use your car. And, Virgo, your car is not going to start up. This person probably want to do harm to a Scorpio. And they was going to use your car. Or Virgo, this is your co-worker, and they wanted to do harm to, like, their lover or another co-worker. Or Virgo, this person wanted to drive your car to work? Something. Virgo, somebody wanted to do harm to you, or they was, they was planning on doing harm to somebody else. But some way, Virgo, you connected to this person, and you was going to get pulled into something. Because you let this person use your car or something. So, I'm going to end it because I don't want over. So, bro, that's what's going on. Something like that is going on with you the second half of November or whenever the energy manifests. So, this is Blood Queen Tarot. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And, Virgo, enjoy the remainder of November and thanks.